Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of The Legend of Zelda Oracle of Ages, part of Portable Summer of Let's Play Corner. When we last left off, we went through past and present, and past and present, and past and present, and beat level 6. So now, and then to make a tree said that Queen Ambi has left the Black Palace, the Black Tower, and we can go, our chance to go rescue Nehru. So let's do that's that. Let's go rescue Nehru. Maybe we've got to rescue Nehru now. There'll be no reason for us to uh, get the last two essences, because we can stop Varen. And rescue Nehru right then and there, so. So let's do that. So let's head to the Black Tower. So, yeah, if we, get, if we can rescue Nehru now, there'll be no reason for us to uh, have him to get the last two essences because, you yeah, know, we'll stop Darren in her tracks, so. So let's head down here. I, I'm so tired, no sleep, just work, but we're almost done. Hello, well, let's head on through here. The Black Tower. Yep, there's a little mini dungeon, so we're going to have to um, be on our toes. But luckily, nothing's too hard. Do we have to be in the present? Don't tell me we won't have to be in the present. That would really, 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 really suck. Because there was supposed to be a cutscene that never showed up. So let's head to the present real quick to see if that cut cutscene shows up. I hope it's... I hope it shows up because... There's supposed to be a cutscene that shows up... With, uh, everything good, so... Hmm... So let's see if it shows up here. Alright. I don't know. No, it is in the past. It's just for some reason the Quincy never showed up. That's kind of strange. Oh well. Maybe that's not a linked. Maybe that's because it wasn't a linked game. It's not a linked. It's a linked game that, that cutscene doesn't show up. So I'm not too worried about that. It's not since it's a link. Since it's a linked game, that cutscene may not show up. So let's just go ahead and head to the Black Tower then. It was supposed to be a cutscene that Ralph shows up and says that you can't just enter through. So um. And then you're supposed to sneak through some guards to get to an underground passage. But since this is a linked game, you probably don't have to worry about it. So let's just make our way through here then. What do you have to say? It's dangerous past this point. There are beasts everywhere and you can't even find your way to the top without getting lost. What's going on? Okay, well we'll find our way. Don't worry about that. Why? Uh, emulator, why? Luckily, none of these beasts are too hard, though. It's just easy, easy. It's just really easy uh, enemies that are one hit kills. So, alright, so let's go rescue Nehru and just get on out of here. Like I said, if we can rescue Nehru, there may be no reason for us to even have to. Uh, Get the last two essences, because we'll stop Nehru, uh, with Nehru, we we'll probably can stop Varen in our tracks before anything happens. Which would be nice, because I do not like level 7 or 8. <laughs> well, especially level 7, though. Level 7 is freaking horrible. Pretty much it's a straight shot, no matter what that guy says, he can get to the top pretty easily, so... So let's just continue on through here. We got like likes. Easy enough. Like like ate my shield. But luckily you don't really need the shield. It's not a necessity. It would be nice to have, but it's not a necessity. Got some easy little enemies up in here. Alright. So let's continue on. Alright.
more moblins. I said pretty much it's just uh, one room enemy, one room enemy, one room enemy right now. So it's not really nothing to it, but we got whiz robes up in here. Luckily, none of the enemies are really hard, like I said. Just, and technically you can skip all the enemies, but it's not, it's not hard. All right, come on. This plus it's nice to have some rupees and stuff too, because we're gonna need 300 rupees here in a little bit anyway. So now we have a choice of three rooms. Let's take the left room first. See what we got up in here. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yay! Hopelessly lost. Gotta love it. Alright, let's look around a little bit. See what we got over here. Alright, so there's gotta be some kind of pattern to this. Let's try two. Three. One, like Oracle, or like Ocarina of Time. Okay, that didn't work. Let's try one. Three. Two. Okay, that didn't work either. So let's try two. One. Three. All right, I mean, I got one more shot. If this doesn't work, then I'm going to look off screen and figure this out. One. Two. All right, I'll be right back, guys. You know, sometimes I can be the biggest idiot in the world. I'm not even supposed to be at the Black Tower right now. Black Tower is actually the final dungeon. We're not even supposed to be there right now. We're supposed to go up to Ambi's Palace further north. I can be an idiot at times. Hooray! So let's head up here to the north. To Ambi's Tower. There it is! Leek, don't startle me. You almost heard the guard on the palace was down and came to save Nehru? If anyone is going to save her as me. I won't let you beat me to it, but it's no good entering from front door. I know there should be a hidden entrance in the palace garden. I'll sneak through it there. What? Why do I know about the hidden passage on my first trip here? Never mind. I'm coming, Nehru! Yeah, I'm supposed to enter up here. And there's supposed to be a secret passage up here. Into a... And just like, uh, or Ocarina of Time, we'll need to, uh, Keep an eye out for the guards and hope they don't sneak around the guard. You you can't come in without permission. Yeah, we, wanna, we have to uh, sneak around the guards and hit, uh, there's four switches we've got to hit. And just be careful and don't let the guards see you. It's a little bit trickier than you think. It's trickier than... So this is what I'm supposed to do. Yeah! I'm a freaking idiot. So the whole time I was in a completely wrong area. Of course. Let's look down here first. This one's easy. And that hits one switch and it moves this out of the way. We need to move those four statues out of the way. So we're going to have to take it nice and easy. Now here we got to just... There we go. Hit this switch, which will um, move that one out of the way. So we're halfway. Hopefully I don't have to hit those again. If I do, then I'm going to be really sad. I'll take a quick peek. If not, then we'll be good and we'll just start on the other side. Quick peek. No, we got them, so we ain't got to worry about them no more. So let's go over here to um, this side. That's where the, the secret entrance is. We need to go over here. Of course. We'll save that one for last. Let's go to the north one and grab that one, and we'll save that one for last. These are a little bit tricky, so... Alright, got that one. 
But just remove that one out of the way. So we just got one more to go grab. Well, that's fine. Kick me out. I don't care. But yeah, if we just rescue Nehru now, we can end this all madness now before we have to go get the last two essences, so. Alright, so let's do this. That didn't work at all. Now, see, this last one's going to be really tricky. If we can get past this, we'll be able to take that secret passage into Ambi's Tower because of all the guards. It's going to be kind of... There we go. Now we'll just kind of squeeze... Ah, wasn't... Wasn't quite there. <laughs> I know what to do now. I know what to do! I know what to do. Alright. As soon as you get in, things are going that way. Hide underneath here. Hopefully don't see you. And there we go. Now take care of the last of the switches. So now let's go take the secret passage. Well, that's fine. Not throw me out. I got everything I need. That's completely fine with me. Good sir. Sir? Sir? Alright, so that takes care of all that. So let's go. Boom. And boom, which opens this secret passage. And now with the mermaid suit, we can swim underneath here. With the mermaid suit, we can swim underneath here. Now we just gotta be careful of these whirlpools up in here. So just be careful of the whirlpools. So just slowly make your way around and go wee make your way up to the top and see this little area right here and there we are quite easy this should take us right to Ambi's castle and we are now inside Ambi's castle so we got a little bit of a dungeon up in here to do so let's t take a look around and of course we got guards to worry about up in here too so but yay fairy that's always nice if the guards see you up in here then they're gonna kick you out anyway so I mean they don't get seen so let's sneak around over here and go go around just like that As long as, you just wait, uh, as long as you wait till you face to the north, they'll uh, sneak through without no problems. We gotta be getting close. There we are! Link, I'm amazed you have come so far! Wait! It's Varen! Do you mean to turn your sword on me? Ha 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 ha! If you want to hurt Nehru, then go right ahead. Now, this boss battle is a little bit tricky. We got to use a certain kind of seed, which I think is a mystery seed. I could be wrong. To lure, uh, Nehru, uh, to lure, to lure, uh, Varen out of Nehru's body. If it's not these kind of seeds, I'll have to go take a look at what kind of seeds they are. Alright, it is. Uh, you put, cause you put Nehru to sleep. Not bad, but as long as I'm in Nehru's body, you cannot harm me! Which means I'm invincible! All right, I'll be right back, guys. Sometimes my creative process isn't there, but what we have to do here is use a mystery seed. And as soon as she leaves the body, use the switch hook to get her away from Nehru's body. And just hit her with the sword. And then repeat the process. It'll probably be easier to use the um, seed shooter on this so we can keep her distance. As long as we keep our distance, we should be alright. And then use the switch hook and... Repeat the process two or three times. Shouldn't be too bad. Then just switch back and forth over and over and over again. That's it. 
Ugh, not bad at all, but just wait till next time! Oh, yes, Gunneru! What is this commotion? Hey, huh? Link? Where are we? Are you truly Nehru? You seem different. You seem nice. Ha ha ha! The queen comes with an impeccable timing! Uh, is that the actual Queen Ambi? Hi, Queen Ambi! She now possesses Queen Ambi. She now possesses Queen Ambi. Okay. Ha! Ah, the body of a queen suits me just fine! Do you know what I'm going to do now? Let me tell you. Meet the petrified ones. I shall catch them all! Uh, what's going on here? Nehru! Hey, Ralph. Is it you? Is it really Nehru? Ralph! I'm sorry to make you worry. I'm fine now. Let us return to our own age. He! What are you doing? Catch them now! And Nehru with the Oracle of Age. See, oh, since she's Oracle of Age, we return to our time. Alright. Hey, Make a Tree. Thank you, Link. You safely pry me from Baron's grip. Now all the strange things that happened in the land should return to normal. Ah, so we did it. We rescued Nehru, and everything that was undone is now back to normal. The little boy that was petrified is now back to normal. Yay. All the monkeys, the monkeys are back. Monkeys. Monkeys. Hi, monkeys. All right. But Link. Baron's still in the past, right? Yep. Baron's still not done yet. If she is, then she can still create an age of darkness that will continue to the present. Sorry, Link. I was one running around while you did the saving. But know this. I'll be the one to stop Varen. I won't leave the people of the past to her evil deeds. Forgetting about Varen now would be foolish. Even if we do, she'll just come back for Nehru again. Ralph, just like you said, I'll help in what little way I can. Link, you have the Harp of Ages. I want to keep it. Uh, I want you to keep it for now. All right. I'm sure we'll continue to aid you. Now let me teach you the last tune, which will unlock the true power of the Harp of Ages. And I'm about to learn a new song from Nehru herself. Yay! You've learned the tune of time. Play it to move back and forth between past and present at any time you want. Choose it when you use the harp. So now all the other two songs are obsolete. You can use it to go past and present any time you want. Oh, 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 Link! Link! Don't forget us! Uh, we gotta, we gotta go get the last two essences. Oh, it's Twin Rova! Hey, Twin Rova! We have a nice to see you after so long, Link. We are Twin Rova, Rudo Riches. You are quite busy in Holodrum. Hee 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 hee. You seem pleased to have rescued Nehru, but Andy's age is already filled with cries of sorrow. By extending the reach of the Dark Realm, Varen has spread sorrow across the land. Soon, the flame of sorrow will ignite. Ho 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 ho! Now only one flame remains. When the three flames burn in the darkness, the evil king shall return. Ho 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 ho! Evil king. Well, so we got Twin Rova. We still got Varen. What was that? Those hags. What are they trying to do? I can't take this link. I'm going back to Ambi's age first. May fate bring us back together. Bye! There is little else I can do, so I'll return home for now. Stop by any time! So our neighbor's going back to her house? You gonna tell me where the summons, uh... Twin Robo's behind Baron? What does she mean by Evil King? What's going on, Link? This gives me a very bad feeling. You must stop it! You gonna tell me where the summons, uh, essence... Link! The next essence! Alright! That's weird! An essence is echoing from inside a fish! So keep that in mind. We're going to start making our way toward this, um, a little bit toward the fish. What is... Uh, so we need to use... Let's use a gale seed to warp... To, to warp to, um... We need to stay in the present for this one. To, uh... No? South Leno. Let's warp here. Let's take a look around. Aren't you, Link? I knew we meet. I'd like to hear your useful tip, sure. You know, this clock shop in Holodrum's Village, right? We already got this. Alright. So let's go two screens south. And now that we have the mermaid suit, we can jump in the water! Alright. 
And we got pirate ships now, too. Yar! Ships of Yar! Pretty much straightforward path here. Just avoid your poor, uh, the, um... Uh, Alright, so there's a house here. Let's check out this house. What do you have to say, house? Hi, woman. My family's been fishing this island since they, my grandpa's day. This island has drifted to the west so long ago it was further east. Alright, so let's go check out this house in the past real quick. With the tune of ages, like I said, everything's so up. The other two songs are completely obsolete. So. And as you notice, it is a little bit to the west, east. So let's go check out this house now. I began my life as a fisherman on this island, but now the island drifts toward the horizon. In my grandson's day, this island would be farther west. Alright, so we're going to end here, guys. When we come back, we're going to explore a little bit around this area and continue on. Because apparently the next essence is inside a fish. We're going to continue looking around and see what we can do about finding the seventh essence. We rescued Nehru, but Varen's still on the loose in the past, creating havoc. So we still got to go defeat Varen. In order to do that, we have to have the eight essences of time because of Queen Ambi now. So we have to go after the seventh essence and stuff like that, and we will take care of our trek to the seventh essence next time on Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Oracle of Ages. This is DKS3, the crazy gamer. Signing out.